inside of managed by stats, there's two areas that you need to enter in two numbers. Basically everything else is done either automatically through our system or through our Chrome extension. The only two things you have to enter in are your cost of goods, obviously for each ASIN. And then depending on how you run your business, you have either additional costs to your cost of goods. So if you have cost of goods, which is basically just the cost from the manufacturer, you could also then have separately your cost to get that product uh, overseas on a truck and to Amazon's warehouse, right? So if you wanted to count those two things separately, you could, if you lump it all together, you just put that all into your cost of goods. So it's just one thing that you'll need to enter for every single product. 